Yeah. Every time I think I'm getting a handle on what's going on, things just get more complicated. It feels like we're always a step behind. The woodsman is the only lead we've got, and he was one of the last people to see Faith alive. Getting some answers out of him will start to clear things up. I hope you're right. Bigby, be honest with me. Who do you think did this? I know it's still early, but I just feel a step behind. Faith was in trouble, afraid of someone. I need to find out who might be whoever she was working for. There's still a lot of questions. We find the woodsman, figure out what he knows, and go from there. Makes sense. That's probably the best approach. You're doing I wish there was really awkward. Sorry. Go ahead. I didn't mean to cut you off. No, it's it's nothing. I just seeing all this today. There are fables that are struggling worse than I'd imagined. We pay so much attention to the residents of the Woodlands. You forget there's a whole community out there to serve. To have to turn to... prostitution. I... I wish there was more we could do. This isn't how I thought it would be. But Crane runs things his own way. Crane is the one to blame here, not you. Obviously, you don't know what I do all day. Right now... I'm the gatekeeper, making sure none of these disenfranchised folks are, as he puts it, wasting his time. I'm more to blame than anyone. You'll fix it. Hmm. I don't know. It's just a broken system. The fables who walk in through the back door like Bluebeard, we have all the time in the world for them. You try and come in through the front door, through the proper channels, asking for anything, needing help. Well, I turn you away. Makes no sense. Now things are worse off than they've ever been. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse, but not by much. Maybe this isn't for me. I thought public service was pure. A way to help. You'll figure it out. You're better than I am with this political stuff. Well, that's not saying much. I trust you to make the right decision. I hope you're right. Hmm. Yeah, maybe you should handle this one. Yeah. Maybe I should. Bigby. I... Um, just be careful. Please. The same goes for you. I will. She seems preoccupied.
What do you want, Sheriff? I'm looking for the woodsman. Well, he's not here. So I guess you can go now. Look, I'm not even gonna ask where he is now, okay? I just wanna know the last time he was here. That's all. Who? I'm being nice, so try again. He hasn't been here for a few weeks. No, maybe. I don't know. But yeah, he hasn't been here in a while, if he's been here at all, which... I don't know. Just like some help, and I'll be out of here. Well, I'd be willing to help you out of here. Would that help? Wow. That's a good response, actually. A lot of these walk out the door? Yeah, it's called advertising. <laughs> you get a refund? Fuck you. The word's getting out. You guys playing right now? Nah. H. Well, that'd be you, Holly. So, who's WD? No idea. Because it's also the first letter in the name. Woodsman. Yeah, I get it. If you're not playing, you don't mind if I... Uh... Lol. Whose is that? Someone who left. Someone like the guy I'm looking for? No, I'm telling you, I haven't seen him for a couple days. I don't know who you're talking about. The one with the bald head and the beard. Never seen him. Hmm. A lot of stools in this place. But there's only one right next to you. You gonna order something? Or are you just here to bother my customers? You know what I mean. Give me a Midas gold. You want a lime? No. No. Well, I don't got any anyway. <laughs> think that's funny? Yep. Think it's fucking hilarious. Mm. It was all right. Come on, guys. I don't want to be here. You don't want me here. The sooner you answer my questions, the sooner I'll be out of here. Will it be him? Holly, you're out of paper towels and... Uh... <laughs> that smile. He knows.
Just gonna sit down without saying hello? You and me have been going at it for hundreds of years. Well, Woody, that makes two of us. You're in luck. I decided to switch seats. I just want to talk. This doesn't have to go like this. Maybe he don't want to talk to you. Why don't we let him tell me that? Okay, Grant. It's funny. Just a minute ago, no one seemed to know who you were. Yeah. Well, everyone knows you. Guy and you're a sheriff. What kind of fucking world is that, huh? Come on, Woody. Why'd you do it? No bullshit. Same reason people do a lot of awful things. For money. I'd walk past her place for weeks. She didn't look like it. She had money. I was sure of it. She wouldn't put up any kind of fight. Finally get up the nerve to do it. There you are, fucking things up for me. You were just in the wrong place at the wrong time. What are you talking about exactly? Red Riding Hood, her grandmother. I was there to rob him. But when I showed up, you were already there, lying in the bed. I only saved her because I thought she might give me a reward. But she didn't give me shit. Except a bunch of people thinking I'm something I ain't. I played along as long as I could. Only thing I managed to get from it was a free drink every now and again. <laughs> Lot of good that did. Did you kill Faith? What? Faith? Who's that? The girl you were beaten on this morning. No, 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 no. I, I was here. I swear. It doesn't look good when a girl you were just smacking around shows up dead hours later. She's dead. Bigby, listen, I, I'm a piece of shit, okay? I know that. I hit that girl. I did. I, I shouldn't have, but I didn't kill her. You believe me, right? They're gonna string me up, Bigby. Like you said, it looks fucking bad. It looks really bad, but I didn't do it. He was here. That's the fucking truth, Sheriff. You see? Bigby. Please, you can't. They'll throw me down the witching well. That's what they'll do. And I didn't do it. You know that. I mean, I believe him. This guy keeps drinking. Hey, stop! This isn't what I want. Oh, shut the fuck up, Woody! Shit ain't just about you. It's about this fucking lapdog. Only comes sniffing around this part of town when the rich fucks in the woodlands need a shakedown. Ain't that right, Big B? You're backing the wrong guy. If you saw what I saw last night, you'd know that. What I see is someone who wouldn't be here if I was the one needing the law for some help. Holly's sister goes missing. No one gives two shits about her. Paperwork, waiting rooms, and that bitch Snow White looking right past me, then ushering me out the fucking door. I wouldn't call her that. It's happened before, and it doesn't end well. I didn't realize you were the bitch of the bitch. Oh, good. I don't start fights. Is he hurt? You should have walked out of here when you had the chance. Come on, you're scaring the lady. Don't worry about me. The 
that hurts. I'm like a little cookie. Lol. That was pathetic. Enough whiskey. Double. Poor glass, just broken. the type of treatment I can expect if I let you take me in? Hey, he started it. Which is true. I didn't hit him. Alright, I got a hundred bucks for the first bloke that can tell me something about a girl named... He's crying. <laughs> Fuck, man, that's not necessary. He's the one you want, not me! Your brother won't be saving you this time. Come on, you're under arrest. I told you I didn't do it. And you got nothing to worry about. I honestly don't know. He still hit me, so... <laughs> Anything stupid, and I'll throw you down the witching well myself. Isn't it like uh, weird to leave just like your suspect handcuffed to a pole outside?
I thought we moved the head. And fuck. It's snow. <sighs> we had something very special. Where's your brother? Fuck you! Give me one good reason I should tell you anything. Where's the rest of her? Serial killer. Oh. Oh my. A serial killer? Oh god, and it's one of us? Wait. The woodsman's still walking the streets. We've got to put a lid on this. If you can't manage it, I'll find someone who can. I found out where she's been staying. I know she's here. You must have seen her. What are the two of you hiding? Thanks for not saying anything. Doesn't matter. Maybe you just want to punish someone. We can arrange that. Huh. What did you do? Uh, friend on friend. At the end of the end. Uh. Uh. Jesus Christ, baby. Is that you? Hmm. Fifteen point five percent held on to your money. Fifty nine percent lied to beast. Thirty eight percent. Want to help Prince? We foretold. You prevented Prince Lawrence's death. Hmm. Twenty-two percent agrees with me that it may be Babe's pimp. Okay. Four percent thought it was Lawrence. What? Who did you arrest? Sixty-eight percent got Tweedledee. Hmm.